So I wanted to show you another way you can measure the action on your guitar. And the only tool you really need for this is a digital caliper. And you want to make sure the one that you have has a depth gauge on the end of it like this. So we're going to start off just making sure that it's calibrated, set to zero. And from here, we're going to measure the thickness of the string we're looking for the action on. So in this case, I'm going to use the high E string as an example. And that gives us about 0.24 millimeters. From here, using that depth gauge, we're going to rest this on top of the string and slowly start to lower that depth gauge until we touch the top of the fret. And what you want to do is make sure that you're not applying any pressure to the top of the string so that the string bends. You want to have the string really stay at the same tension as it was without pressing down on it at all. And we're at about 1.63 millimeters on that high E string. So again, all we really did was we measured the thickness of the string, zeroed it out, and then rested this part here on top of the string, and let the depth gauge go down to just where the top of the fret is, and that difference is what will give us our string action. Hope that helps.